All right, guys, here we go. We're going to go down the list of uh, NFL games 2022 week 13. So we feel like, uh, or I feel like I've made some some good picks this week. Um, I know a lot of people are scared to do picks this week because the games are just so tough. But I got a couple of upsets uh, that I feel like I feel pretty strongly about. But with that said, let, let's go down the list. Steelers Falcons first game uh, this week. I'm I'm going Falcons. This one's a coin flip. Tough to call. Uh, I'm taking Atlanta in this one. Just my gut tells me Atlanta is gonna gonna win this one. Uh, next up, we got the Broncos Ravens. Uh, this is a no brainer. Going with Baltimore in this one. I can't take Russell Wilson on any side. I don't know that I would take him against a college team right now. So uh, definitely, definitely going Ravens. Packers, Bears. This is my first upset of the day, maybe upset of the year. I'm going Bears in this one. I think Justin Fields has, has a good rushing day against a pack. I think this is a Super Bowl for the Bears. Uh, a lot of bulletin board material. That I think the Bears really show up in this one. The Rodgers and the pack, they're down and out. I think the Bears capitalize, pull off a huge, shocking upset today. Uh, if you're betting money, I would bet money on the Bears today. Just my opinion. Um, just really think Chicago is gonna gonna show out today. Uh, Jags Lions. I'm taking the Lions in this one. I think the Lions are much better than their record. Um, incidentally, I think the Jags are better than their record too. But I think Detroit just has a lot of firepower. Over there, so I'm going with the Lions. Uh, Browns, Texans. I, I can't ever pick the Texans. I, they're probably the worst team in the league. I'm going Browns in this one. Uh, it's the return of Deshaun uh, Watson. And uh, all he has to do is hand the ball off. Browns have the, the combo best running backs in the league. Uh, they should have a much better right. All, all you got to do is run the ball the whole game against any team. Just run the ball. Um, crazy that they don't do that. So uh, definitely take Cleveland in that one. Jets, Vikings, to me, the Mike White hype is just what it is. Mike White hype. Uh, Vikings, I think, going to gonna really uh, bring Mike White down to earth today. Um, Vikings just have a little bit too much firepower with Justin Jefferson. Um, I just don't. Don't see the Jets being able to hang with them. Commanders, Giants. This is another upset that I'm going with. I'm taking the Commanders today. Um, I, I just, Tyler Henneke, just love the guy. Uh, for whatever reason, these guys play for him. He's a, he's just a in-your-face, dirty, nasty kind of guy. And I think the team plays that way. Uh, with him at the helm, I, I'm going huge upset today. Commanders over the Giants. I think the Commanders have a new, refresh lease on life here in the NFL, and I think today's the day they make a, a their first real statement win and get right back into the thick of things in the playoff hunt. Uh, Titans, Eagles. I'm going Eagles on this one. Um, AJ Brown just gonna be too much. Uh, for the Titans, Rams, Seahawks. I'm going Seahawks on this one. Uh, the Rams are battered, beat up. I just think Seattle takes it to them. 49ers, Dolphins, probably the game of the day. I'm, I'm going Dolphins in this one. I do have an emotional bias since I'm a Dolphins fan. Uh, but I'm going Dolphins all the way in this one. I just think that the 49er Garoppolo, I just don't think he's ready for a shootout type game, although the 49ers have a great D. Uh, I think the, the Dolphins' little dink and dunk game, yards after the catch, is really what's going to solidify this game for Miami. Yards after the catch, dink and dunk, quick quick releases from Tua to the wide receivers, and they have yards after the catch, and I, I think that's how the game's going to go. Chiefs Bengals. This is another one of my upset picks of the week. I'm going Bengals. Um, I, I know everybody's going Chiefs. I'm going Bengals. I just think uh, this this is a real meaningful game for Cincinnati, and this is one of them games they're looking at as a Super Bowl or 
playoff type game. And they, they want to get in the, the thick of this thing. I think Burrow, I, I just think the Bengals are going to pull it out. The Chiefs, they, they've been winning, but I just feel like they're kind of wobbly. Um, and we'll, we'll see, though, but I'm going Bengals in the upset. Chargers, Raiders, I'm going Chargers. Kind of a no-brainer in that one. Colts, Cowboys, I'm going Cowboys. Uh, Je- I like Jeff Saturday, coach of the Colts, but I just don't think that they can – they just don't have the talent level that the Cowboys have. I just just think they get outgunned there, uh, Cowboys in that one. And Saints, Bucks. I'm picking Brady and the Bucks in this one. This this is one I'm shaky about. Wouldn't surprise me if the Saints won, but I think when it's such a close coin flip, uh, you got to go with Tom Brady. So that that's my picks of the week. So let me know how I did. And uh, let me know your thoughts about that. That's my picks of the week. And then let me let me see if I can maybe share them on the screen here. Let me see. See if I can get them on the screen right here. Maybe I can take a picture of it somehow or something. Let me see. It's not as easy doing this um, with one monitor. It's much easy doing it. Much easier doing it with two monitors. So let's see here. I'm going to get these on the screen so you can see them. Probably got to make the font a little smaller to get them on the screen. So that's what I'm going to do. This font smaller. Maybe that worked. Maybe it didn't. Oh well. I guess this is a bad time to to sit here and try to mess with my downloads folder and try to figure out how to do things with one monitor, huh? (laughs) Well, maybe this will get it here now. Got it now. Watch this. Yep. Just can't do it with the one monitor. What I was trying to do. Oh well. Oh well. Anyway, that's my picks of the week. Good luck, guys.